When I said Kalala, they have a washroom, they have a shy washroom, they have a dash. The band has three apostles of Graham and Stone. Shalom to all the brothers and all they keep pushing the stroke. We are the Hebrews so like to come out of a weekend. Professor, the downfall of this wicked kingdom. You know, mainly America. You know, the white man's kingdom overall. And to declare salvation of the elect of the nation of Israel. You know what I mean? Which is our Lord and Savior, you're our shy, but you're ignorantly called Jesus. You know what I mean? He's said to be the one who is going to bring us as a people, as a nation, salvation. Yeah? And that's what we believe in. Yeah? See? Now, our people try everything. You know what I mean? And everything, but nothing else but fail, man. You know what I mean? Now, we grew up in this society where basically, um, we look to certain leaders um, to, to, to steer us in the right direction and they all but nothing but fail man you know what I mean all our leaders fail us you know them have no might <laughs> you know now our leaders per se the um, future of our people basically at some point we used to believe in those men that were set up above us you know and they re realize that the enemy is the one who put them in place well, you have our people trusting those men, you know. But the, those people basically carry the same vibration. Are the ones them who sell out the Lord, man. You know what I mean? Because our people basically, seeing who them look to as them leader, seeing as them shepherd. You know what I mean? It's nothing pertaining to what the Lord would appear, man. And the same thing with the prophets of the Lord, man. The way how we appear, it's nothing what them want to see as being the prophet um, concerning anything to do with righteousness, man. So just like how them despise the Lord and sell him out, it's the same way them all despise us and sell us out, man. You can, you can see based off of how people react to us um, as an example, you know what I mean, of the sentiments of them of towards us and even the Lord because if we come out here do our own thing saying we'll be ready to be accepted you know but we come out here speaking the word of the Lord and we get rejected man yeah sure that you people despise the Lord you, you, um, the Lord is not what is pleasing unto you you know so we're going to come out here to bring this message to the elect of the nation of Israel and the, and the elect will hear, you know, and add themselves to the fold. So this is Isaiah 53, verse 1. Who art believe or report? Right, so the scripture says, Who art believe or report, man? Seeing <coughs> come prophesying of our Lord, the our Bashem Yawashai, but hey, all people don't believe that. Because ever since the Lord on the scene, they reject the Lord up to this point. Ye are they that kill the prophets, and ye are they that reject the Lord, man. And we out here as a witness against you, niggas, yeah? Go on. What, what leader or report unto whom is the arm of the Lord revealed? Right. <laughs> For he shall go up before him as a tender plant, right. and as a root, right, um, without a dry ground. Right. He had no, he had no form, nor comeliness. And when we shall see him, there is no beauty that we should, that we should desire him. Right. So, <clears throat> Lord, <clears throat> sin in no form or fashion, sin. It's in a way where you, the two children of people is going to accept him, man. And based off of his faith 2,000 years ago, seeing you can see that the mindset of where the people mind is, man. See? Conspire to kill him, you know? And today, they would, they would do the same thing again. Example, how we know that, how, how, how them do his prophets, man. You know what I mean? One. Right. Verse 3. He is despised and rejected of men. Right. right. A man of sorrow and acquainted 
we grief right. and we hid it. We hid as it were on faces from him. Right. And he was despised and we esteemed him not. Right, so you know the spirit is the same thing happening right now because the, this is the word of your Awasha. A matter of fact, when we read the scriptures, we're bringing out what your Awasha is about, man. And same thing what people doing today in the spirit, man, hiding their face from him, man. They want they don't want your scripture none at all. You know what I mean? Straight up rejection. Him come in person, reject him. He come in you know, the volume of the book, rejection. So you know what the Lord is gonna do? The Lord is gonna reject you, man. The Lord is gonna reject you. You know what I mean? And that will come in a ways. Wait, wait, wait. It's not gonna be nice. See? I believe it or not. Death and destruction is at hand, man. Seeing the, the, the prophecies that is written from afore, seeing are being fulfilled and are um, fulfillment. Seeing now we are about to enter the time where this man is going to implement his, 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 his RFID te technology, which is the, the mark of the beast, man. And a lot of our people have a fall faith, man. They fall for the okino. They take the chip, the Lord is going to destroy us, man. Yeah. Surely he had borne our griefs and right. carried our sorrows. Right. Yet we did esteem him. Hey, because what the Lord did was pure love for our people, man. Our, our people in return for him. And yeah. uh, what we are doing, a man might say, I will come out of the way, I cuss away, say two thirds of the dead. But guess what? Guess what? See? No. Hey, when you look at it on another level, that is love, man. Love for our people because actually we're not saying that. Um, they might have burned in one place for help and not help for help or we, hey, we never come out and say that. We make you know that look, two thirds is gonna die, or they're gonna come back in the kingdom in the right mind, man. Yeah? We never condemn them forever. You know? It's a lasting condemnation. Like how Christians do it and some of the Israelites go. See, so what we what we be demonstrating out here is pure love for people. Can we come out here and tell you the way? Oh, you should, you should go. You know what I mean? We're not trying to lead it on a path where, you know, it's going to breed a bad result for you. We're actually telling you. The thing is, you rejected it, man. And by you rejecting it, hey, we, put, we pronounce judgment upon you. For the rejection of the Lord, word, man. Because, hey, when the Lord punish you people, it is just and righteous, man. See? Your actions alone show that, look, when the Lord put hell upon you, it's well deserving, man. You know what I mean? It's not like we're um, um, with people um, out here basically um, wanting to get around the Lord. No! You go about your business, you see the brothers are out here for weekend. You know what I mean? You go about your business, you don't give a damn. So the judgment comes. Hey, can you not go cheer that? Yet we did esteem him, stricken, smitten, of the hour, but he was shy and afflicted. But he was wounded for the transgression. Yes, yeah, so the Lord, the Lord come on and die. Yeah, that, 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 our people can't be saved, man. And in return, what the majority um, do is, is hate in return, man. Absolutely no love, man, apart from the elect. That's why the elect, right now, the blood of the Lord, they are washing our shine come and cover the elect. You know what I mean? This time around, those are the ones who are going to make it um, through the tribulation, man. And it's going to come up on the planet, yeah? So, but he was wounded for our transgression. He was bruised for our iniquity. Right. The chastisement of our peace was upon him. Right. And with and with his stripes we are healed. Right. Right. See, so with our service, we give thanks to the Lord, man. Um to, 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 to make that sacrifice and to us. That's why we're out here um, um making our, our ourselves a sacrifice also, man. You know what I mean? See? Coming out into the highway and byway, putting my life down. You know that. You know, to 
show our appreciation with it. You know what I mean? <coughs> and, and hey, just like for the Lord suffer, we, we are we are we are expected to, to suffer the same man. So the servant is not greater than his master. You know? And it's a first Peter um, 2 and verse 5. He also are lively stones, right. are built up a spiritual house, right. an holy priesthood to right. offer up spiritual sacrifice right. acceptable to Yahweh by Yahweh Shai Mashiach. Right, so we're supposed to um, lead on our lives, man, doing this thing, man, which is a spiritual sacrifice, man. Seeing, loving the brotherhood, you know, which is a spiritual sacrifice, man. See? Because when you check the love, as the scripture said, and feel love for the brethren, it's basically sacrificing a lot. You know what I mean? I think they really mean something to you. You know what I mean? You do it for your brother, man. You know what I mean? See? Because that, that basically will make the whole thing perfect, man. I'm having um, real love. Not, not, not saying loving with. with with words, but in deeds, man, for the, for the brother. You know what I mean? That is the main thing, man. They say, um, the scripture tells us, um, charity for the, for the brethren, yes, you call it cover a multitude of sin, man. You know what I mean? Hey, apart from when you, when you check it, when you check it, <laughs> when you check it, you know, it's so sad, man. The only thing we really basically we can turn to right now, see and see true love, a true family, you know what I mean? We, we basically brothers look out for brothers, man. It's basically among this truth, man. You know what I mean? Hands down, man. You don't care what kind of organization you put yourself a part of, man. It's it, it not solid like brothers being in this truth, man. See? And we have one common um, um, standard of father, and that's the scriptures, man. Only scriptures alone could have bring people together like oh brothers come together under the umbrella of the scriptures. You know, so one time um see, one time one lady say the brothers move in the park and they basically she basically say, Oh, we we'll do this man, oh we come together. Seeing like this, so much young men come together like this and just do what we are doing. You know what I mean? Continuously. You know what I mean? But guess what? It's, it's, it's not money, you know. It's not um things away. We basically we have personality where we have been come and no. Seen, but the scriptures, man, because you have brothers coming from all different walks of life doing this thing, man. You know, if we're not the world, you have certain men, um, the type of lifestyle where they live, or we're not the world, a different lifestyle we live from them. So we would have never um, cross part, man. But when it come out of the world, yeah, we, we have that in common, so we, 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 we can um, we react um, um, according to the scriptures, man. We can interact. Yeah, one brother. This is First Corinthians 13, verse 2. Right. And though I have the gift of prophecy <coughs> and understanding and understand all mysteries right. and all knowledge, and though I have all faith, right, and so I could move a mountain, right, and I have not charity, I am nothing. Right. And though I bestow all my goods to feed the poor, and though I give my um, my body to be burned. And I have not charity, it profited me nothing. Right. So, hey, we, have, we, have, we have to demonstrate that love for the virgin man. And part of that love basically is, is what? Make sure some brothers are on the right track, man. You know what I mean? Some of the time it come off like a tough love. You know what I mean? But here, you know, it's set brothers straight, man. You see the apostles every day. Um, um, every day the apostles saying, look, man, man, they need to get into the spirit, man. Get into the spirit of, of doing this thing. You know what I mean? Um, push as hard as I can, man. Hey, look, it's not because I hate and him want to be a, a oppressor, you know, or not like that. No. The apostle is not trying to be an oppressor, man. See? Because at the end of the day, see? You have, you have to deal with your Lord, your shy, man. See me? If it... Uh, it, it thing is, you know, um, Jake is... Uh, is Jake coming out the church? Jake, read... Read, um... When somebody check for you, them read it as something negative, man. Uh, when somebody check for you, they actually try to set up on the right path. And oftentimes, it don't come nice. You know what I mean? Oftentimes, it don't come nice, man. 
say? Is it true that say no um um chase it because it's grievous man? You know what I mean? But after all, you can get you know, Come on, me, I feel offended because when I come at you, you know what I mean, I press at you for do certain things. Hey, look, man, is that, is that, is that it, brother? See, it's basically a check. I'm gonna show you, say, yo, check for your well being, man. Because if, if I tell you to do that, if I don't do it, you're gonna be destroyed, man. Ultimately, you're gonna be destroyed, man. So, man, basically, when I push you for do that, 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 and I'm gonna be one, be a lot over the Lord's heritage, man. Yeah?